Real power means that we don't have to be dependent on ourselves. We can be dependent on God because He's the one who's in control and He has that power. God's like uh, uh, His real power and how it affects us in uh, His ways. Really, it's God's grace inside of us. It's the power to um, answer the call, even though we fall short um, because of what Jesus did on the cross for us. Jesus is, is calling me in spite of all my mistakes and mess ups and all my sins. And he wants to be with me no matter what. And all I have to do is just answer. When we are weak, God comes in and is strong. He chooses us and uses us despite our biggest weaknesses and flaws, despite the fact that we struggle with sin. He comes in, redeems, and then chooses to use us to share His name with the world. God uses our weaknesses um, and helps us through them and works through them. In, in their weaknesses and in everybody else's weaknesses, God will show through and God will, um, God will provide through that. Peter is a great example of an average human being just like us that was called by Jesus and his life was changed by him because he answered and followed him. We believe that we're nobodies and that we're not fit and we're unworthy of that and God calls us and says no. We are not qualified as Peter was not qualified. We're just ordinary and God chose us and he's working through us. God sees through their weaknesses and sees the value and the purpose and the identity that He places in them and that He wants to fill them with His power. He wants to use these campers and see them thrive for His name and see them share His name with others. I hope my campers realize that um, when they go home, this power isn't just a camp. It's not something that stays with them here. It's a uh, omnipresent thing that is continually with them and inside of them. And it's something that they have access to no matter if they're at New Life Ranch or back in Tulsa or back in Northwest Arkansas. Um, I would love them to walk away with an understanding that God loves them, sees them, and desires to use them. I am going to help encourage my sisters and their walk with Christ and help be that disciple for them. I'm gonna answer the call and follow him every day with my whole heart.